Hey YouTube, Reggae Frank 9 I have a spicy food review for you. Uh, today I got something a little bit different. It's from Ass Kicking. Uh, it's one of those companies that I've said before, it's 50 50 with them. It's either a hit or a miss. It's either like a real big miss when it's a miss, too. So, I don't know. I still buy their products, though, because uh, I'm always running into them. They're just always available in uh, some of the stores I shop in. So, this is the ass kicking dill seasoning dip. Comes with a little canister right here of the seasoning, and attached to it is this little uh, vial of hot sauce. And uh, it's really easy. I just made it. I got it right here. I got a bag of chips. I haven't even tried it yet. Um, let me read off the directions real quick, just so let you know what you got to put into uh, making this stuff. You mix one and a half cups of sour cream. A uh, half cup of mayonnaise, six tablespoons of ass kicking dill um, seasoning, the dip, and it says a refrigerate overnight, serve with vegetables or crackers. Use your ass kicking hot sauce sidekick, spice it up. Um, and this is for an additional flavor, which I'm not going to do because it's disgusting. Uh, add two tablespoons prepared horseradish and or half cup chopped green onions. The onion's okay. I'm not too fond of horseradish. Ugh. Disgusting. Nasty, nasty, nasty. Um, and then your little sidekick. This, it tells you like a little meter. One third of the jar is medium heat. Two thirds is a hot. An entire jar is ass kicking hot. We'll see. I use the whole thing. Uh, and this makes five 16 ounce servings. So this is 16 ounces right here. Uh, probably a little bit more with the mayonnaise mixed in there, but pretty much 16 ounces. It's a uh, 64 uh, point, 0.64 ounce uh, can. Let's see here. So it's 18 gram. Okay. Let me read you the ingredients: dill, weed, parsley, basil, chopped onions, salt. That's it. So, uh, I paid, uh, I think I paid six, five ninety nine for this, so we'll see if it was worth it. I got enough for four more servings, so hopefully I like it. If not, um, I don't know. <laughs> Some little cheap ass, 99 cent store chips. Cheers, guys. Let's see how this is. I really like the dill flavor. Let's see. Okay, the dill flavor is really, really good, but I'm not picking up any of that spice at all. But the dill really, really is uh, flavorful. I might actually throw some um, Maruga Madness in here, or, or one of my hot sauces. I'm going to get a little spicy. I'm barely tasting that sauce. This is only um, 0.75 ounces. It's so tiny, and I use the whole thing. All of it. And uh, it's not doing justice. I might add something to spice it up. As is right now, it's going to get a zero on heat. Uh, like I said, ass kicking is either great or shit. That's the only option with this company. And uh, more than half the time, it's shit. Unfortunately, I'm just telling you guys the truth. Um, I'm a sucker that I'll keep buying more of it. <laughs> uh, maybe I'll find something that's really, really good and I'll, they'll redeem themselves. But, uh, Flavor, I'll give it a nice three and a half. The flavor of the dill itself is really, really good. So, they got that going for them at least. But uh, for chili heads, you'll be disappointed. The heat is like non existent. 
Maybe if you don't eat any spicy products, this might be a little spicy for you. Maybe like a tad bit spicy for you. Probably not even, not at all. Seriously, it's it's horrible. The spiciness is horrible. Anyways, like I said, I'm going to add some, uh, probably some Maruga Scorpions or something in here to heat it up right now. And enjoy it, because as it is right now, it's a big fat zero in heat. Alright, well you guys have a good one, and until next time, keep it spicy.